Hi there, welcome to this 10 minutes morning yoga practice. I got inspired by a friend who's going on holiday. She asked me if I could include some sound salutations and postures for her to do every day while she is on holiday. So here it is. Okay, so coming to, let's start, right? So if you've got 10 minutes, it might actually with relaxation go over slightly. So I apologize if it's so. Come on to your tabletop position. We'll go straight into sound salutations. Bring your toes, tuck them under, come into downward facing dog, lift the hips, head relaxed. Look forward, walk towards the top of your mat. Roll your spine gently and come up into your Tadasan, the mountain pose. We'll be doing Surya Namaskar B, which includes warrior postures. We'll take the first one really slow, the second one slightly faster. Your feet together, palms facing forwards. Inhale, arms up. Come into your chair, Utkatasan. Stay there for a moment. So make sure your hips lower and you try to reach up towards the sky. Forward fold, bring your head closer to your legs. Relax the head. Fantastic. Look forward, create that straight back. With your fingertips, push the mat away from you. Plant your hands, right foot back, left foot back. You're into plank, so engage all these muscles and feel the arms, legs, your core, even your glutes. Knees on the floor. Come and lie down. Fantastic. You into cobra. So use the leg power, core power. Lift the spine up. Exhale, downward facing dog. Relax the head. Fantastic. Bring your feet together. We're going to warrior one. So look forward. Right foot next to your right thumb. Drop your back heel, engage all the muscles on the legs. So you've got loads of leg power. Lift the arms, bring your hands together and look towards your hands. Warrior one, hands down. Let's do the same thing on the other side. Right foot back, you into your plank. Lower your knees, come and lie down. Inhale, lift. On your cobra, exhale downward facing dog, relax head. Feel the stretch at the back of the legs, inhale through your nose, exhale through the mouth. Left foot forward, right, he right heel down, warrior one, reach up, look up towards the hands, bring the hands down, come into your plank. Lower your knees, come all the way down. Inhale, Cobra. You could look at the sky if you are practicing this outside. Downward facing dog. Let's stay here for three. While you're in downward facing dog, so you could like observe the body, your arms, your legs, your spine, your breathing pattern, I'm assuming it's very early in the morning or you're practicing this early in the morning so you might be a bit stiff so you could move freely okay so make sure you, your downward facing dog is free look forward we'll walk all the way at the top inhale Arda which means half lift downward down your head sorry into your um forward fold okay it's been a while since i did one of those videos <laughs> because of my situation as you know so we are on our um utkatasan which is the chair so you lift up i don't have any space <laughs> reach up all the way and bring your hands into in front of your heart pause for a moment very good. Come into your Tadasan. Let's do that one more time. Okay, so inhale, arms up. Lower your hips, your chair. 
forward fold hug the legs this time shift your weight slightly forwards feel the back of the legs halfway lift plant your hands walk back left foot right foot so if you can lower down without using your knees okay so inhale shift your weight forward exhale lower down come into upward facing dog if it is safe for you okay so if you don't know what upward facing dog is and you've never practiced before please carry on with cobra exhale downward facing dog warrior one on the right side bring that right leg forward carry it if need to lift up fantastic come into plank again exhale lower down inhale up facing dog exhale downward facing dog fabulous left side warrior one back heel down warrior one so you reach up towards the sky very good plant your hands down come into your plank strong inhale exhale lower down upward facing dog or cobra downward facing dog fantastic let's stay for three okay one good two more like this so your inhalation and the exhalation is slow deep so you try to lift the tailbone up and try to send it back lift the knee calves very good look forward walk halfway lift out of and forward folding onto your legs and hold onto your ankles so a little bit more try to come closer a little bit more come into your chair inhale up all the way exhale bring your hands in prayer fantastic so we'll fold again slowly plant your hands come into your tabletop so let's do a fantastic long exhalation inhalation cat and cow inhale extend your spine look up exhale come into your cat look towards your navel let's do two more inhale very good exhale last one slow movement and breathing exhale round your back stretch your back fantastic and relax bring your right toe outward all right plant your toes so you tuck them under the left leg wants to extend right let's send the right hand all the way forward so you've got more space we are now stretching our side body look towards the sky and feel that beautiful stretch on the side left side stay there left foot plants to the earth and left hand reaches forward away from your head last breath and lower down let's do the other side left foot out right foot plants don't forget to send your left hand forward slightly we don't want it right under your shoulder reach and feel that right stretch your gaze should be somewhere that you're comfortable you could do the sky tip of your hand or the floor do you see all these rotations on the neck so do what is really good for you last breath and lower down very good come into downward facing dog lift up relax the head we'll go into malasan i really like this posture it opens the hips ankles and it's a really good one for the digestion system so you might find the heels up don't worry about that 
put maybe towels or blocks underneath your heels. Lower down, bring your hands in prayer. So what I want to do now is reach forward. So when you reach forward, lift the hips slightly, right? Lower your head and bring the hip back, hands in prayer. Let's do that two more times. Reach forward. Exhale, lower. Last one, reach forwards and lower. Fantastic. Plant your hands downward facing dog. Very good. So I would like another rotation on the spine coming to your tabletop. Okay, your toes could relax this time. Bring your right hand up. So try to see the right palm. Okay, here for two. So the left arm, you really engage the arm muscles, your core, your hips. Okay, last breath. Bring it down. Let's do the other side. Left arm up. So you reach up with your left hand. Push really down and root down with the right hand. Two more breaths. Very good. And plant it down, downward facing dog. We'll do a twist, lift up, inhale. Exhale, relax, right hand onto your left ankle. Look towards your armpit, stay there for three. Try to engage more on the left arm. Try to engage your glutes and send the push, push tailbone back. Last breath, beautiful, bring it down. Do the other side. Look at the right armpit. If you can't reach towards your right ankle, you could walk your feet forwards, okay? Or hold on to your calf. It's all okay. Last breath in. And ex. Fantastic. Bring the knees down. Slightly open them. Bring your feet. We are onto our child pose. Head lowers down. Stay there for three, two, and one. Fantastic. Come on to seated position, comfortable seated position. Hands in prayer. Okay, so what I would like you to do is inhale in three. Pause for three. And exhale in three. Carry on with that. In, in three. Hold three. Exhale in three. I advise you to increase the seconds four. Let's do four. Inhale one, two, three, four. Hold for four. Exhale in four. Perfect. Let's do another one. So you inhale, get that oxygen into the lungs, the air, feel the lungs and hold. And exhale in four. Relax the shoulders. Fully the air comes out of the lungs. Fantastic. Bring your hands in prayer. It's going to be a beautiful day ahead. So what is your intention today? Just think about your intention. How your day should end up what do you really want out of your day it could be just you know having a comfortable beautiful day stay with your thoughts for now this short practice might have changed or I don't know, made you recognize things that you haven't before. Bow to that. So inhale, exhale. Wishing you a beautiful day. Thanks for practicing with me. Namaste.